never did. Cooper, never did. your bars, last time yeah. we'll use them. I know, right? <laughs> okay. All right, we think we're... We think we're live. Woo! Hey, uh, so uh, TikTok, we're live on TikTok. We're doing a uh, hot tub happy hour. Uh, this is my final hot tub happy hour. And um, so we can't, you've got my phone up there. I can't see the comments. Um, Ryan, our producer, is here. So he occasionally will be able to see some of your comments. So uh, we might be able to take some comments and respond. So we love having you here right now. So. I, we want to make sure, I guess uh, Ryan says we're streaming live to, uh, to Facebook, are we? <laughs> are we? But are we? I would like to know. Where is it? I don't see it. Can you find it? Well, is it on? I got it on the phone. It's yeah? Can I try to it's working? Anything. Uh, the computer says we're streaming, though. Oh. Well, we're on YouTube. For sure, I'm sure, right? Yeah? Maybe? Maybe. We don't know. <laughs> We don't know. It's all Consider tech stuff. This is the pre-show. This is the pre-show. Yeah. Yes, welcome to the pre-show. Pre we're yes, we're we're waiting for y'all to, to to show up. Go grab a cocktail. It's Friday night. Ready. We are ready to party. We are ready. Because it's uh yeah. So this is Savannah. You guys haven't met Savannah yet. Oh my gosh. Uh, my my people on uh, Hot Tub Happy Hour. You guys uh, on uh, Facebook and and YouTube have probably seen you. It's been a while. I think yeah. your glasses are, are, they're glaring, are glaring. They? Yeah, they're glaring. They're super cute, but they are glaring. They glare here. on. Yeah. I'll put them over here. I'll just be blurry. So you got 114 okay. on the old tickety talk. On the tickety talk. Anybody talking to us? Ryan's helping us out. So. Uh, uh, somebody said kiss. Yeah. You don't have to read all those. Typical. Thanks, Ryan. Oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah, thanks. You don't be one of those dudes, okay? Please. Seriously, we're so over that. All right. Well, you know what? So we're going to be getting this started, and uh, and what we're doing is, YouTube. yes, going? Going on YouTube. Going on YouTube. Boom. All right. Uh, but we don't know about Facebook. Okay. Well, that's all right, because we have you, and we're very happy you're here. So this is Hot Tub Happy Hour. I'm Sue Bonzel. This is Savannah. Hi. My beautiful assistant. She, you probably, so we, so we started Hot Tub Happy Hour uh, during the shutdown, like when there was like nothing to do. Like, stay inside, stay at home. Right? And we so stayed at home. We stayed at home and <laughs> drank in the hot tub. And so uh, first I kind of started the show and I was like, you know what? I got my hot tub. I'm just going to do like a hot tub happy hour. Let's just, you know, I'll have some wine, talk about some Sonoma County wine since we're here in Sonoma County wine country. Maybe make a cocktail or two. That's what, that's what I'll do. I think that's what I'll do. And so I basically just hung out in my hot tub by myself, uh, just making shit up and uh, having a good having a good time. Uh, so I, I tried to be as, you know, as fun as possible. And so I do have a clip. We're going to show some clips while we're here. Uh, we're going to show a little bit of the evolution of Hot Tub Happy Hour and like where it started and where it went to. And, uh, and then we have an announcement later, uh, which I'm super excited. We're going to play a little game too, because that's part of Hot Tub Happy Hour, either games or trivia or Something. Something. Fun facts. Some fun, fun facts, fun, yes. Fun facts for trivia later. Right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we, had so, we had so much fun. Uh, so one of the, so the first clip I'm going to show you is basically it's just me by myself. Just trying to, <laughs> just trying to like have some fun with some stuff. And you'll just see I'm like a total like dork. So this is the first clip. And then when we come back, we're going to uh, teach you how to make a drink so uh, you can drink along with us for Friday night. Ryan, hit the clip. Uh, it's not as bougie as it is more redneck white trash, uh, but I think a lot of people will really like this one. So, yeah. It's a white claw. Come on, people. Really? <laughs> you, you should expect this of me. All right. Let's give that a try. That's alcohol plus alcohol. Mm. That's a nice way to deal with the uh, the box wine. Okay, I'm on board with that one. That one's going to be, uh, this is called <laughs> Headache for Tomorrow. Oh my God, that was so fun. So I'm like, <laughs> so no, seriously, somebody gave me a box wine and I'm like, if you know me, like we, I mean, we're, we love wine. We're into wine. I used to, my family used to own a winery. She works at a winery. And so like wine's a big thing for us. And somebody literally gave me a box wine as a gift. And I'm like, what in the, do I do with this? <laughs> like, seriously, I'm like, I'll make some spritzers. So then I'm like, well, let's 
how do we bougie this up? And so uh, that's what I did. And, you know, it actually wasn't too bad. So she missed out on that one. I wasn't here for that one. Did you have glitter bombs for that one? I did have <laughs> glitter bombs, too. They were like, you know, the little bath bombs. But yeah. those were disgusting. <laughs> they were so gross. I highly do not recommend at all. Don't recommend at all. Um, so we're going to make a little drink. I found this drink, and it's called Southside. Hey, we got another visitor to the oh. tub. Uh, uh, yeah, go go grab one. There's no pl there's no more plastics in there because they're all they're all packed. <laughs> so find what you can find. <laughs> That's how we're rolling today. Uh, so we're gonna make a little drink. This is called Southside. I'm gonna call it West Side because we're on the Cause west side because we we're on the west side and then i'm going to be going to the east side of the country uh so we're just going to make a drink oh you know what i forgot ryan ice ice ice, ice. Ding. it's cold enough out here ice yeah. ice baby we need ice there's i forgot the ice, the ice. Dang it. it's not right. snowing out there's here. a there's a <laughs> there's a bowl on the counter maybe uh julie can get it julie can you fill up that bowl on the counter with ice please <laughs> Thanks, to have some warm cocktails. Right? <laughs> well, we're, we're in the hot tub, so it's okay to have a little cool cocktail. So, um, you know what we're going to do first? Let's do this. So, I got this game. Ah, this is called Hot Seat. This is kind of cool. It's called Hot Seat. And it has these little cards. And so, um, we're going to just, I don't know, play a couple rounds. Here's a little notepad for you. Okay. Yeah, we're doing paper in the hot tub. Here you go. There's a pen. Better than off. a toaster. <laughs> that's, mm, that's that coming. That's a good one. That's coming. That's <laughs> coming. Okay. So we're going to pick a card, and uh, I'm going to pick a card, and and uh, I'm going to read it, and then you're going to write down what you think I would do. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. Seriously? All right. What one word sums up my experience with the opposite sex? Oh. One word. What is it? What one word sums up my experience with the opposite sex? <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> Your ice machine is very slow. One word. One word. <gasps> thanks, pumpkin. Here's mine. Okay, thanks. In just a moment, we'll uh, we'll get you all set up. Okay, can we still see everything? So George says, "Hey, from Jersey Mamas." George. I'm Josie. Hello. Hey, I'm George uh, from Jersey. Danny Wartman's back on. Danny. Whoop, whoop. Yay, Danny. All right. Okay, what one word sums up my experience with the opposite sex? So, so Savannah's going to try to come up with the word that I would say. That I would say. Well, I kept it clean, and I said spontaneous. <gasps> oh, that is clean. And I, that's accurate. Somewhat I would say, accurate. I would say spontaneous. You can go yeah. in any can direction go? being spontaneous. <laughs> Like Julie's about to be. Julie's about to be spontaneous. Oh my God. Hold on, girl. Hold on. She's, what word would you she's... say, Sue? I don't, you know, I don't know. We need your answer for this I would one. probably say uh, my my experience with the opposite sex, uh, probably challenging. How about that? Frustrating. Frustrating. Yeah, that's a good word too. Yeah, either one of those. Okay, you get to pick a card. Ooh, I get to pick a card. You get to pick a card. We'll do one for you and then Somebody one for me. Somebody wants to know where the Jules is. Jules, Jules is coming. Hold on. Oh, Hold on. Oh Hold on. We're going to get her in here. Uh -oh. What is at the top of my bucket list? Top of your bucket list. Oh, okay. Oh. Mm. Top of your bucket list. <gasps> top of your bucket list. I guess I don't really have to write it down. I was going to say it. Um, top of your bucket list. What is the top of, it? What is at the top of Savannah's bucket list? I am going to say, oh, um... I don't know, maybe, well, it's not really be the top of the bucket list, but I was going to say be a wine, like a wine judge. Ooh, that's a good one. Uh -huh. That is on it. That is on the bucket list. I'd say the top, though, is traveling through Europe, like multiple oh, countries, like long the... period of time, not just go for a few week every once in a while go, but I want a long, extensive trip. I like, that's a good bucket list. If you guys have bucket list items, let us know in the chat. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Vince, Vince says hi, by the way. Vince, what's up, bro? <laughs> okay. So, we got to make a drink, but first we got to get Jules in here. So before we start making drinks, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna go to uh, our next set of clips here. Are you ready for this? Uh, so, like I said, I started doing the show. I was doing it by myself, and I was like, well, this is boring. I need I need like somebody. I need somebody fun. Like to come and join me, and of course, what else do I do? I'm like first before I got to bringing somebody on. I was like, 
How can I make this more fun? I don't know. Costumes, maybe. Let's do some costumes. So um, I dragged Savannah in on the costumes as well. So uh, let's take a let's take a look at a couple of those clips from Hot Tub Happy Hour. Like, oh my God, you guys! It's totally the eighties, and it's um, Hot Tub Happy Hour. Oh my God. <laughs> I was having a wardrobe malfunction with my hair because, uh, you know, it's really hard to do the side ponies, uh, obviously. Uh, uh, what we're going to do today, have some wine, we're going to pair it with some I'm junk food, <laughs> plus I have some fun facts about Twinkies. I learned all kinds of stuff. I mean, this is so much fun. So first of all, I have to take this off because number one, it already fell in the hot tub and it's a little bit wet. And it's kind of disgusting. But I'll gonna tell you why I'm wearing these. Because you didn't recognize me, did you? Okay. You'll notice the bag is empty, and this is what's left of it. <laughs> it's the Reese. They don't last long. Oh my gosh. The Reese's Ghosts. I had not seen these before. I saw them somewhere, and I found them online. And I'm like, I have to have them, and I have to try them. So we are going to um, pair it up with our wine. There you go. And of course, like I said, I've had one or two of these already <laughs> and I, I almost they think with the movie last night they did. <laughs> and I almost think they might even be better than the original uh, Reese's mm. peanut butter cups I'm not even kidding so it's white chocolate with peanut butter on the inside oh. <laughs> so, cute. Mm. so that is like heaven I mean it's white chocolate we'll see if it goes with the white wine I'm always down to try it Hmm. Ooh. That's actually really good. I know it works. Mm -hmm. I'm actually surprised. <laughs> <laughs> it was so good. That was really good. That was a good one. Hey, Jules is Hi, in Jules. the town. Jules is in the town. Jules has arrived. Okay, well, then it is definitely time to make some cocktails yes. because Jules is here. So uh, let's let's get this going. Now, you know, if you ever watched any of my Hot Tub Happy Hour, you will know that I haven't. <laughs> Tiny shaker, teeny tiny, teeny tiny tiny one. It's personal size. It's it personal makes size. For her. Yeah. So I'm gonna make. I think I'm gonna have to make them like one at a time. Yeah. And the other, right, they get better each time though. They the do. Ratio, they do. They right. Exactly. <laughs> so the other thing with if you'll you'll if you watch the show you would know that I am not really a great bartender, but it's okay because it has booze in it. She so it's a strong drink, that's so, for sure. So we're doing we're doing a little tank array. Oh, look at that. We're gonna make this one a little bit strong. Let's see if we can get two drinks out of this. Whoa. Brandon Jones says hello. Brandon, what's hey, happening? Brandon. Brandon's on the tickety talk. Okay. So we got gin. We got a little bit of this is lemon juice. So I'll see. A little single servings. Lemon juice. Ooh. Oh, just relax. Yeah, we can always add more gin. It's fine. No. <laughs> and a little bit a of little floater. lime juice. And but wait, there's more. Look at this. Look at look at <gasps> mint. Ooh. So it's kind of like a gin mojito. Kind of like say. we don't so, have to muddle anything. We don't have to muddle anything. But somebody once told me it was Nicole Martin. She was yes. like, "You gotta smack your mint. Bad mint. <laughs> smack that mint." Ooh. Smells good. Can we smell? <laughs> oh, mm, okay. Yeah, right. Hope the filter is still like mint. Okay. So one guy said, <laughs> if you were a vegetable, you'd all be cucumbers. <laughs> cucumbers. Ah! Ah! Cute. Cute. Yeah. So That's this better is... than corny. You can do that too. <laughs> So this is later. <laughs> this is Julie's mating call. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. I got excited. Slippery, slippery slope. I slippery slope. In. Slipped in here. All right, this girl needs a cocktail. Holy yeah. crap! Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna do minis. Like we're doing minis, but we're gonna we're gonna top it off with a little tonic water. This is the good stuff. This fever tree stuff mm, is like the that. best. Okay. No one didn't bring me straws either. Oh. It's got something floating in it, but you know. Mint. Oh, is that? <laughs> oh, is it? Is that a bug? I don't know. Go with it. 
Okay, we'll see. There's if we... sometimes extra ingredients in our drink. Right? We don't know. I don't know. It's not like when you get something and you have an extra part that you're putting together. You're right? Like, there's, uh... there's extra pieces. <laughs> No, no, Look at that. I'll just put that in the drawer. See, this is what we do. We make teeny tiny, teeny tiny little, little it's drinky the starter booths. starter round. It then. is the starter round. It is the starter so round. Don't so dive in too deep, right? Okay, we need a little bit of this. Oh, okay. Do you want some ice in yours? No, I. You want some ice in yours? A little bit. Yeah, I'll have a little bit in there. I'm using my hands. Look, <laughs> gross. Yeah, I'll throw one in there. Okay. There you go. I wanted to use the strainer just because it had the mint in it. You know, yeah, how you yeah. get the mint like stuck in your teeth, and you're like, ew. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Be on camera. Nice there you go. Okay. Nice. okay. Here we go. Oh, that is. Happy cheers. Friday. That cheers. is our west side, south side, west east side, side. <laughs> north side. Cheers. Mmm. Oh, Ooh, that's quite good. <gasps> I have to say, your bartending, your bartending skills, skills, skills are have improved. Why? Thank you. I do hot time happy hours. The better they get. All right. The more we drink. <laughs> The better they taste. Okay, I was a little nervous with all that lemon, but mm -hmm. mm. there you are. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna do one for Julie. Julie, pick mm. a card. Jules is picking a card. Pick a card, any card. Okay. Here we go. Let me read it. Oh. Okay. Is this oh, that's like a good throw? one. Yeah. What do I have zero tolerance for? Lying. <sighs> Hypocrite. <sighs> Cheaters. Oh my God, she knows me so well. Holy crap. Okay, well that was easy. Zero. <laughs> like, I accurate. We were to guess for Julie. <laughs> and, no, no, she said it was for me. Oh, got it. And then. Oh, uh, oh. Then, I don't know what I'm guessing for oh, anymore. No, that's for me. Oh, I, I think that covered all too. the bases on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Zero tolerance. There you go. Okay. Read it. Who is this for? I'm gonna. Yeah, we're gonna. We have to guess for you. We have to guess for you. Oh, so you read it. Yeah, I'm a little late to the game. Okay. Oh, I thought this was a massage. I'm like. what? Uh, what did my last text message say? Oh. Get over here now from her. No, right. <laughs> right. I can tell you what my last text message said. Well, says. hold on. I'm not sure that I want to know. I'm going to guess. <laughs> well, number one, I know it didn't have emojis in it because of a text, <laughs> a text thing we did today. Um, so it doesn't have emojis in it. And I know that for sure. That's what it doesn't have. She hates those it two. May, Zero it, tolerance no. for emojis. It may have an F-bomb in it. Hmm. Yeah. Oh. No. Oh. No, it did By didn't. close. Yeah. I bet the conversation had an F-bomb in it. Uh -oh. um, Is that a good guess? Previous one. Okay. But the reason why I'm late. Oh, uh -oh here's your You okay. want to hear my, my late story? Okay, late yeah. story. <laughs> late story. I could not leave my house and garage because uh -oh. I was being stalked by a dog mm -mm. that I don't know. And he kept running in and out of my garage. Are you kidding? Me? And wouldn't let me leave. I had, what? To, I had to go into my house, <laughs> unlock my front door, go back in, and then go and shush yeah. him out, close the garage door really quick. He kept running in and, and tripping it. Yeah. Like, oh I'm my like, gosh. Go I'm like, go run. And he's like, run quick. And then he'd come back, and I'm like, who are you? Get out of here, you I gotta psycho go. dog. So, yes, my last text message was I can't leave my house because I'm being stalked by a dog. That's not one I would ever guess. And you know, there might have been an F-bomb in that. There might have been an F-bomb. An effing dog. Trust me. Yes, an effing dog. Yeah, an effing dog. I know this girl. Trust me. Trust me. I'm sure you were responding to get over here now. Yeah. How's everybody in TikTok land out there? Matt Wolf says hi. Hello, Matt. Hello, Matt. Thanks for joining us. Yay! Okay, we're having fun. Okay, this is all right. Fun. So I've got noticed some... that I picked the red solo cup. She did. She did. She's just a classy bitch. I am. <laughs> this is my classy girl. Oh, but wait! I got it. Speaking of cups. Uh oh. Okay, you know when you go and you get drive-through fast food, whatever. <laughs> yes. And they have that turquoise swooshy and and swooshy. you know you know on the cups. Oh like, yeah. Okay. Like you can literally go to sports warehouse, sportsman's warehouse, and buy. Yes, wait for it. An entire suit for snowboarding and snow skiing. That, wait, looks like a to-go cup. <laughs> I even have a picture to prove it. Oh, my God. I stood there like seriously. <laughs> you want to buy it, huh? I might have to. I might have to buy it because you know when I moved to Nashville, yeah. and it's like it's like twelve degrees there right now. Yeah. Like, so, if oh. wanna, so if you want to look like you're to going, to going, to going, to go, to go, to go suit, I'm to go, I'm to go. <laughs> okay, so so we talked about the hot tub happy hour that started during the shutdown. That's the little show I started, and I was sitting in my hot tub making cocktails and drinking wine and just 
bullshitting, basically talking to, to myself, herself, so which I'm so good at because I do radio. I'm in a room talking to myself uh, all the time, like every day. So, um, so yeah, so so I brought uh, Savannah on. We had some fun. I had some uh, some special guests that joined me in the hot tub, which was super fun. Um, so now we talked about we made these drinks, and I said. I'm the world's worst bartender. Uh, no, we she did. She did. I, I say it she all. The, I say it all the time. So I do have Anytime a couple. Anytime we were about to make drinks. Well, <laughs> remember now. Remember I'm now. I'm like going into surgery and going, you know, I've never actually performed this surgery before, but we're going to give it the old college try. <laughs> That's right. It's just brain surgery. Well, you it's know. Not That's a big all. Deal. No big deal. <laughs> so, uh, so I've got a couple clips. I'm trying to see which my clips are here. Um, yeah, we, uh, yeah. So this is me oh. attempting to make... Uh, oh, these are the teeny tiny moti mo the mojitos. mojitos. So this yes. is where it all started. So oh, let's, let's uh, roll. Brought me back. Let's roll the clips. You can tell I am not a professional bartender by any means because um, if you are a bartender, you know I'm probably not doing this right at all. But it doesn't matter because it's got rum in it. We shake it up. Ooh. As long as it tastes good, we're good. Oh, it's gonna be great. <laughs> okay. Here we go. We're gonna pour these in here. I think we should have made more. That's a teeny tiny little. That's a little bit. <laughs> like, okay, what are you drinking? <laughs> Serves one. Serves one, maybe, because this is a tiny little shaker. Oh my gosh, yeah, we're. Okay, we didn't. We we're should have practiced. More. That's okay. But you know what we're gonna do just for now? We're gonna drink them. Oh my goodness. I don't know if this is gonna be any good. It's gotta be good. It's got vodka in it. <laughs> and um, we're making it the orange Russian because I'm going to put in just a little bit of Grand Marnier, a little bit of the orange liqueur. Just for fun. Just because we can. Okay. The only way to get better at this is to do it more often. So <laughs> I definitely need to practice my bartending skills. So, so here we are. <laughs> Yeah, basically, I'm not a great bartender, um, and so we are we are streaming live on TikTok, uh, which is like over there. They cannot see the clips, so y'all on TikTok, if you want to see the clips, uh, you can go to, to the Hot Tub Happy Hour YouTube uh, and see that. So we're gonna have that up there, and all of our past episodes, and all of the past episodes <laughs> that are so much fun. Yes, so <laughs> so that was fun. So we had a we had. A great time. I did it on Wednesdays. We did Wine Wednesdays, and then we did Fun Fridays. And you, you joined me mostly, mostly for on Wednesdays. Wine Wednesdays. Uh, so I work on Fridays. Yeah. So she's sometimes hustle over here to, for a Friday. But um, we had we had so much fun, and I'm sad that we're not doing it anymore. I am moving from Northern California to Nashville, Tennessee, where it's 12 degrees Cheers. right now. Cheers to that. Cheers to that. Place. I do Cheers. not. It's better. There is not a hot tub at my new place yet that is on the list so the I think, bucket list I, no, yes exactly list. it's, on, it's, a, it's on the should have been top of the list Travel i got a hot tub happy hour i got a shopping list a mile long for the new place but um but the hot tub is definitely on the list so in the meantime I took a little break last year in 2021 uh from doing hot tub happy hour i think everybody was kind of like yeah, yeah, kind of played out. We're not, we're not stuck at home anymore. We were opening everything up, and uh, everybody was kind of doing their own thing. So I kind of took a little break from the hot tub happy hour. And in the meantime, I started a new show because that's what I do. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, this girl's gonna have her own network, right? Exactly. Yeah. Bonzel Network. It's the Bonzel Network. network. <laughs> there you go. It's BNN. <laughs> But it's not news. <laughs> country, uh, news. country news, yeah, exactly. So um, I've been in country radio for more than 15 years, and uh, here in Santa Rosa at 93.7 The Bull, and uh, I'm going to continue to do that through the magic of technology. We can uh, we can stream anything. I can do anything from anywhere. So I'm going to continue to be on the air, which I'm excited about that. And uh, so. There's all of these new artists that, that come along, and my country, my station plays new country. So I love new country. I'm seeing all these new artists, and I'm like, oh, I really like that song. Oh, I like that song. And I started making these lists, and I was like, oh, I think this one's going to hit. I think this one's going to hit. I think this one's going to hit. And I was like, oh, I think I'm pretty good at this. Like, <laughs> She's only been in radio a little bit. A little bit, you know. And so um, I said, God, it would be really cool if I could, like, interview some of these new artists and find out what they're doing and 
hear about their journey and country music and all of that. And uh, at the same time, uh, our producer Ryan, who's behind the scenes, <laughs> he's hey, Ryan. Ryan. He's oh, like, don't let's not talk about Ryan. Ryan they, oh. No, Danny loves Ryan. I know. I know. <laughs> Danny loves Ryan. TikTok blew up with Ryan right? last night. Exactly. <laughs> but Ryan and I started a business during the pandemic as well. So we have now a video production company doing live streaming. And so we said, well, let's do our own show. Like, this would be super fun. And I'm like, well, who's going to talk to me? Like, who wants to, like, be on a show when I just started and I just started reaching out to these country artists she on, did. Crazy. on Crazy. Instagram. Like, who, should I, who should I contact tonight? And I'm like, everybody. And she's like, okay. <laughs> who shouldn't you contact right? is the question. So yeah. I, I reached out to a handful of people, you know, on, on Instagram, just like, hey, what's up? Uh, you want to do an interview and then I'll play your song on the air? And, and people were like, yeah, sounds good. And I'm like, um... Okay. It's easier than I thought. Wow, that's cool. <laughs> Although some people are really hard to reach, and y'all know who you are because I've been stalking you. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. right? <laughs> well, no, let's not, not, let's not say that. Not, sto word. not stalking, you know, just I'm, yeah. I'm fanning. I'm yes. fanning really hard. She's so. trying to be a groupie. Yeah, I am. I am. So I started doing these, these interviews, and uh, we've done, God, I, almost 40 now, wow, I think. That yeah, awesome. which is That's super great. cool. That's awesome. And uh, we just did, uh, we just recorded two today that will, we record them first and then we uh, push them out uh, every Tuesday, 10 a.m. They go live on the YouTube page and on um, Up and Country. That is the name of the show. Uh, it started out as Cow Chair Country. Cow Chair. I was sitting in my cow chair. Mm -hmm. We were having cow chair sessions. Mm -hmm. And then people are like, couch? What's cow? What's couch? And, uh, and I'm like, Okay, that's not a good name, I don't think. <laughs> I mean, it, it's descriptive, but it wasn't quite right. And, yeah, um, I know. Wrong vibe. Ryan and I <laughs> made, a, made a trip out to Nashville, and we were trying to figure out, you know, what would be a good name? Uh, and we were at... Uh, we were at one of the... We were at one of the bars downtown. Oh, no. Shocking. Yes. Yeah, right? And then, I don't know, I said something about up and coming, and I, I said up and country, like, accidentally, instead of up and coming, because it was up and coming country artists. I'm like, it's up and country. I'm like... <gasps> That's the name of the show. It's up yeah. in country. Uh, so started the show, started getting all these people on, and uh, it and I've had such a great time. I have met the most amazing country artists. These these some tell of them. Tell us here. Tell us here. Tell us here. I know. So I know. So, so oh, place no, no. Too. There's there's been so many. Uh, what you know? I had so many favorites. Uh, you know, you probably heard of uh, Craig Campbell and uh, oh like God. Breland. Oh my God! Breland. Love me some Breland. And, uh, oh, my daughter's here, so she's, yay! <laughs> yay! Uh, so, so I'm going to show a clip of the show. I just picked one. There are multiple to choose from. This was actually one of my all-time favorite interviews that I did with Pr uh, Brett Kissel. Brett Kissel is a Canadian artist, and there's a lot of country uh, artists out of Canada. Oh. Uh, so you'd be surprised. You'd Great be like, oh. Music. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. So we had an absolute blast, and I love his accent. He's got the Canadian accent, the whole deal. So what I did with him was uh, I I looked online. I found a bunch of Canadian terms, basically, of like that. I'm like, what in the hell is that? Like, what is that? And I asked him to explain to me what these Canadian terms were. Uh, so we had some fun with that, and I've got a clip to show you right now. And you're good at this. This is good. Okay. Uh, what about a, uh, hang a, hang a Roger? Oh, yeah, hang a Roger is, uh, or we're going to, you know, just take a right. Or if you want to go left, take a Larry. Because it's like, or, or if you want to do a, this is really good. If you want to do a U-turn, you, you can call that a shit hook. Or <laughs> you can call that flip a Hank Snow. And I don't know why, but it's like, it's so cute. and because if you say a right, say I'm going left. And they're like, right. Right. No, no, no. Right. right. <laughs> No, right. no, left. Okay, right. I'm, <laughs> left is right. No, 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 no. You only take a Roger or a Laird. Right. <laughs> that makes the most sense. I mean, I'm going to have to adopt some of these things. This is good stuff. <laughs> I mean, it makes total sense. Like, hang a Larry, that's a left. Like, seriously, like, if you can't yeah. figure out directions, that's the easiest way. I'm like, that's yeah. freaking brilliant. How come we don't do that here? Unless your name is Larry. Unless your name is Larry. Yeah, and then, like, I don't know. Oh, I don't Someone know. might not be too happy about that. Exactly. I don't know. <laughs> Kelsey, are you going to get in the tub? No? Okay. What's in your cup? <laughs> oh, it feels good in here. It feels really good. It doesn't feel cold at all. 
So that is the that is the new show that you can follow. Uh, it is on YouTube. It's Up and Country. You can follow it online, upandcountry.com. Uh, I have a, a Facebook group, Up and Country. If you want to join that, we're doing some fun stuff there. We do. Um, we also have. You can follow me on TikTok. It's just it's me basically. If you follow me on Instagram or on TikTok or Facebook or whatever, um, I, I, you will see Up and Country because I put it everywhere. Oh yeah. So yeah. So can you tell me about the other up and country thing that you do on that show? Oh, the other up and country thing. Yeah. So I have plans, uh, and they, they are fully in the works, going legit, uh, with up and the up and country foundation. And so I would like to um, bring teens who are interested in getting into country music uh, out to camps out in Tennessee and to be mentored by some of these people that I've been interviewing, uh, doing some, you know, learning some songwriting, having some songwriting opportunities, uh, and learning a little bit about the music business, you know, the things to look out for. But the biggest part is um, building self-esteem and self-respect for these teens. And so that's a big thing for me. Um, and so that's the thing that I want to do. That gets me super, super excited uh, to be bringing something like that to uh, to teens and to really lift them up. You know, even if they don't end up going into the country music industry to become it's a, take them so far. it's exactly it's in their lives and, and their, their parents' self esteem, their and personal their parents. being, their parents, yeah. yeah, their parents get involved. Exactly. And, you know, mm -hmm. and, and as parents of a you know a young a teen trying to get into the country music, there's a lot of things they need to know as well, especially if they're going to be the manager or those kind of things. Oh yeah. So I'm going to be bringing. Cool. I want to bring on all these experts. Uh, to work with the teens, work with the parents, um, and really help them and have like a life-changing experience. So that's what I'm working on, the Up and Country Foundation. Uh, I, I'm getting everything dialed in. It'll be a 501c3 nonprofit. Uh, so I am going to be looking... I'm gonna be hitting y'all up for some donors so I can make this thing yes, happen. Who wants to be a part of it? Yes. Right? Let us know. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Exactly. So cheers to the foundation. Yeah. Yes. Cheers to the foundation. So cheers to the foundation. Cheers. 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 There you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well. Oh, your cat joined us. Oh, no, there's a kitty. There's a kitty. There's a kitty. Anybody want a cat? Oh. She's not <laughs> Just, coming. Uh, I don't know. I'm scared to take her. I don't I'm know. I'm scared to drive that. her to the airport. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I almost sent you a text and be like, I can drive you and Ryan, but, but I ain't not the, the cat. cat. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. Enough <laughs> after what I heard about what the other one did in the oh, game. Right? No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, I'm a little bit nervous about that. Yeah, if you got tips drug for you know, oh, I'm gonna have to drug animal her. CBD. Yeah, I can get you some. Yes. yes. Yeah. We're gonna yeah, we'll just like mm -hmm. got you. Okay, <laughs> I got you. Drug her up. <laughs> we're gonna drug her up. That's what we're gonna do. Okay, that's gonna be fun. All right, so I've got a couple more clips to show you guys before we wrap it up. Um I'm super excited that, that we got to do this. This was fun. I was excited that you two could both join me as the final farewell for a hot tub happy hour. Now, as I was doing the hot tub happy hour, there were several times when I brought, well, I call them like power tools, uh, not like power tools, <laughs> like, you know, an electric mixer, blender, a blender toaster. toaster. And then oh, the most yeah. controversial one was the toaster. Uh, everybody was like, what in the, f are you I crazy? was so freaked out. I was like, what the hell is she doing with a toaster she goes, next to the hot toaster. tub? Like, and I was like, yeah, no problem, got you. I'll just bring it over, not even thinking about it. Oh my God. Not I, worried. <laughs> So we, I, I told we're here I today. told I told the person I was with at the time like I can't I cannot watch this I can't I can't and <laughs> I did this episode out I didn't it's I couldn't so watch it it's like danger I know. danger I watch it danger keeps us on <laughs> edge okay it gives us a little thrill in life so no, when I, mean, I was I like myself a thrill but <laughs> yeah, not electrical uh -huh. right. Uh, I've been well, there, done that. So the ones that I did with the the mixer and the blender, I was actually outside <laughs> oh of the hot tub. I stood outside the hot tub and I actually did those with the hot tub in the background. Uh, this one in particular. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We. So. Um. I can't. I can't remember if this one comes first or not. I think it does. Is that? Does that? Is that clip? The, that's the first one. Okay. So it is. It was. It was a National Waffle Day, and so uh, we we got some Eggo waffles, and uh, so it was all about the food. We did a lot of food stuff. So you'll see the uh, waffle episode. I'm also going to show you some clips from behind the scenes when it was National Oyster Day. Oyster Day was fun. And we did some oyster shucking. That was super fun. And uh, what else did I have? Lobster Day. Oh, wait for it. Lobster <laughs> Day oh. in the hot tub with Great. my special did guest, you, Did you Jen. boil it in here? Just well, wait Well, you got to watch. You got to watch. You got to watch. that one, too. You got that one, too. See. We didn't have any power tools in the hot tub for that one. No. Now, if you lobsters. If you, if you <laughs> missed any of these, these are some really fun clips. If you missed 
any of these, uh, you can find them uh, at Hot Tub Happy Hour on YouTube. And uh, I think they're, I still have hothubhappyhour.com. I haven't done any maintenance. It's probably a little dated, but. Uh, the YouTube is where it's at. Though. The YouTube yeah, is where it's at. Just there's, watch them. There's some behind the scenes and some bloopers and all kinds of crazy stuff. Bachelorette so, highlight reels. Yes, Ooh. that was good too. I go watch I that one. Go it's watch not in our home. recap. Go watch it. It's her, it was her bachelorette party. Oh, it was wild. Mm, it was Patrick good. was the star. It was a good one. Okay, so we're going to, uh, Ryan's going to run those clips of all the food and the fun we had. Uh, the Waffle House sells 145 waffles a minute. Per minute. 145 in one minute. Oh my gosh. Uh, they, uh, they've they been open for 60 years and in the total of 60 years, the Waffle House has sold 877 million waffles. <laughs> Who knew you could start a business selling waffles? You know, kind of like a business selling coffee. <laughs> Huh, who knew? <laughs> who would want that? <laughs> who, would, who, would, who would pay $5 for a cup of coffee or even more? Well, I guess we will. Don't <laughs> 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 <Just> scare me. We're ready for barbecued oysters. Okay. He's already kind of opened up a little bit. Let's say hello to the say hello to my little friend. Wait, hold on. Wait, I might need this. Okay, glad we kept that. These are uh, upside down oysters. <laughs> Altogether possible that I did it wrong. Hundred percent true. Oh, well, this one's the mother. This is the mother. Look at that one, oh, mother. Oh. Okay, that one goes to you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the now, agree. are you ready for lobster? Uh, who's not ready for lobster? So I've been working on this all day. I'm ready. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, ah! I got the lobsters. <laughs> They're ready. Straight out of the hot tub. Straight out of the hot tub. It was like a it was like a slow cook here in, in the hot tubs. Oh, See, look at that. Look at that. Lobster, Chardonnay. <laughs> Just doesn't get any better than that. I really did make lobster, but I made it on the grill. <laughs> Check this out. Check. She's amazing. Check it out, people. Look okay, at this that. Goes back. There we go. A little bit of lobster on the grill. Uh, that was so <laughs> much fun. I was like, and I, so Jen was my, my guest in the hot tub for the lobster day. And I did not tell her I was going to do that. She was just <laughs> like, what the, f what? <laughs> F-bomb? Right? <laughs> exactly. That, that old F-bomb. Yeah. So we had a damn good time doing hot tub happy hour uh, there's more there's i don't know you never know i could resurrect it again maybe every once in a while we just might have an episode exactly um, i don't know stay tuned. how's our tiktok doing what, what's happening over there uh somebody wanted to know if you got room for one more yeah plenty of room come Are on you in santa rosa yeah, right. <laughs> there's plenty of room somebody's looking for a green card so not in santa rosa yeah, no. <laughs> Somebody wants you to, someone to do a cannonball. Oh, there you go. I tried. Julie's on. Julie I tried. was gonna. I so. She I'm... was gonna. She was gonna. I'm... She was gonna. Somebody wants to know if I'm still locked in the bathroom. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's Danny. That's probably Danny. <laughs> you locked him in the bathroom? No. no. <laughs> you would, I don't know why they thought that. You would never do that. Come on. Not. We just know that. I don't know what they were talking about. Oh my god, I can't night. wait for this story. Somebody would like you to have a drink on them. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Cheers. Cheers. I'm empty. Cheers. We'll make another one here. Uh -oh. Make another one. I need another round. Mm. Pull me. Oh boy, here she goes. Pull me <laughs> Julie's gonna be on Up and Country. Right? I am. I am. She actually is a songwriter. We, we actually I write country songs together. She's, yeah. we've, got, we've actually got a couple of good we've ones. We've got. We got some good Seven. ones. I you bet. Just wait. You just wait. It's happening. Yeah. It's happening. Okay. So here's the deal. For all y'all, uh, watch. See, I'm already working on the uh, the Tennessee accent. You got for, it. For all y'all uh, <laughs> watching on Facebook and YouTube, uh, thank you guys, and I want to thank everybody. I had a lot of a lot of people that tuned in every single week as my fans and uh, always interacted and we always had such a great time and I really really appreciate the support I hope you enjoyed it I hope you guys enjoyed this little farewell show we're gonna uh, cut the feed on that uh, we, we might we might keep the TikTok going I don't know just because TikTok's you know, dang fun it's and fun and then we we may have to turn it around so we can actually see some of your comments and uh, and we'll respond, get back so. on later <laughs> yeah <laughs> we'll see and we need to make some more cocktails, more cocktails. Yes. Yes. So, blue cups. So, what's that? You want me to stop? Well, hold on. I'm going to say goodbye. I, I say goodbye. Okay. <laughs> We're all ready to say goodbye. <laughs> Thanks Aww. for joining us, you guys.